Hello and welcome to another installment of Green Dawn and welcome back last to another video another tutorial video. This is part 5. Today we're gonna explore we're gonna explore some more and sadly enough we're not gonna level in this one but we are close. Also I got the new equipment a maze and uh, a maze that I'm gonna change later on and uh, an amulet that gives you 3% more experience. Gear that gives experience is good to have. I will be getting some from my stash because I was debating if I wanna use the potion but I don't think so. Also the lost caravan quest begins in the foggy bank. This is important. It will give you one spare merchant and that will become important if you play the assets of Malmark because uh, well but let's say that the merchant on the left side, he dies. Yeah, big spoiler alert. Not so much if you play the game. But yeah, that way you have an extra vendor to sell in town. Otherwise you will not. But when you finish the normal campaign and get to the DLC. That is if you have the DLC. But yeah. Also the foggy bang, this area is kinda short. We will be fighting a very special unique in it, but yeah, and get some new gear. As you can see, the mesh is too slow. I will change it back to the sword because it's too slow, especially when you get free frozen by these the summons and the uh, casters, yeah, those spell casting, the spell casting uh, sled guys, yeah, you see how slow it is, it's ridiculous, I'm gonna switch back to the sword, I'm gonna stick to the sword with him because, well, let, let's say that cadence doesn't offer you attack speed, not right away anyway. You will get more attack speed if you do the command aura, which I'm gonna get, but yeah. Oh, come on. What is this? Truck? Okay. This is ridiculous. Each time I wanna record, there's trucks everywhere. Really. Oh, great. And on, now the neighbor wants the lawnmower. <coughs> the neighbor with the lawnmower. I have to edit the noise. I don't think the microphone is that strong to pick it up, but yeah. Also, that was the merchant. I got um, teleported back to town. I got lucky and he spawned close to me. The random, uh, the chances, the places he spawns are random. But don't worry, there are not too many. I believe there are three in total that he can spawn from, or I could be wrong. If I am, don't grill me, please. Thank you. But yeah. We'll be getting a lot of stuff here. A new weapon, a new armor that I'm gonna wear. And possibly enough money to buy myself a new inventory slot for the regions I'm gonna get. Yeah, I'm not gonna keep all these in my inventory. I'm just gonna keep the the scrap metal. The rest I'm gonna deposit in my private stash. You, if you want to, you can do this. You do. You can do this also, and it's important because that way your inventory, main inventory, is not cluttered with a lot of stuff. If you wanted to keep tidy and organized. But that's only up to you. Oh, come on. Right. Another truck. There's a mall around my area, so there's tons of trucks around. There. But yeah. Ooh. A two-handed mace that is green. Too bad we're not doing two-handed weapon build. That would be awesome. That would have been an awesome find. Indeed, it would have been. But yeah. That skill's not ready. Mm. God damn blood. 
goddamn ass. What do you call them? Mosquitoes. Yeah, giant mosquitoes. I really hate them. But yeah, that's the amulet. It gives you, among other things, 3% more. We and we're gonna find from the boss in this area a neck another necklace that I'm gonna wear. True, it's for a poison build, but nah. Gives a lot of cool stuff like resistances and such. And energy regeneration, which the soldier kinda needs. But yeah, I'm gonna keep that. Not gonna sell it. I'll be stupid if I would. But yeah, as you can see, we're doing great. The difficulty level is not that, ba that bad here. But yeah. More crappy gear. I'm gonna have to make a trip back to town. I was debating if I wanna edit them out, but I think I'm gonna leave them on. Just so you guys can see what I sell and what not. But yeah. I'm not gonna hurt all the junk from v veteran and elite. Is that worth it? The only junk you want to hold is well. That skill's not ready. From ultimate. I have an, an assortment of starter equipment that I keep for fast leveling stuff and stuff. Most of them I used on her. Some of it is still in my stats because it's not for this class anyway. Yeah. My first build we used fire as a damage potential. So yeah, the mace was kind of for that. Because uh, for the aura, uh, the, because the ability that gives you f fire damage also increases your attack speed. I forgot what it is. Also, frozen heart. Nice. I'm gonna have a, another one and a scrap. Cool. But yeah. Ah uh, yes. But yeah, around here somewhere should be the boss. You can get the quest from Devil's Crossing to kill her, but I didn't get lucky and the quest didn't trigger. <laughs> but yeah. If you're lucky enough, you can. Do it. But nah, not in my case anyway. Also, there she is. Primordia, the forgotten one. As you can see, oh yeah, step away from that. It will kill you. Also, you, my friend, have to go. Bye. As you can see, she freezes you a lot. And also does that. But don't worry. See how much damage it, she takes. I really love amplified uh, amplified the amplified damage. Otherwise that fight would have taken forever and there you go a lot of gear and a necklace the putrid necklace It gets better with difficulty, but uh, as far as uh, this one's considered nice I'm not using blood of drag. I could be But I don't think I want to make it po her poison based Hmm Still debating who cares? Anywho there it is. Cool. I'm gonna keep that amulet in my stash. I'm gonna need it for other characters. You know how hard it is to find an amulet with no level requirement also? Back to town. With one inventory bag in Act 1, you're gonna be doing a lot of these, trust me. Also, that's the vendor right there on the right. Let's go talk to him soon. We're gonna talk to him soon. Oh, look at him. Yeah, man, thanks. No problem. I got some reputation. 
Soon I'm gonna be friendly with them. That means I can buy two potions that I'm not gonna ever use, ever. Usually I don't bother with the devil crushing stuff. Usually. Also, miss the altar. But yeah. Good armor. Nice. The armor will be equipping. Because we're gonna have it. We're gonna need it. It, and it's way, way better than what we have. Also, wow, that's a lot of stuff. And a gun. I should have kept that for my other build, but gun, two-handed gun build, but yeah. I have a better one on her, I believe. A blue item. Item, blue colored one, but yeah. Oh, yeah. And with that, the inventory is full. Almost. There you go. Organizing the junk. And I believe, yup, this goes here. Oh yeah. Look at that damage up armor upgrade. And the health. We're gonna need it. Also, here you go. Another gem for you. I love those floor polished emeralds. They're awesome. But yeah. Going back to cell. Sorry, if you're annoyed as I am, I apologize, but that's... You know what, fuck it, I'm gonna cut it. On the less, <laughs> on the next series. I swear, I am gonna cut them. Cause this is insane. You don't have to see me go to town every time to sell stuff. That's stupid. Also, 10,000 new stuff. Oh, okay. I shouldn't have done that. Put the emerald back, thank you. But yeah, this will be mer primarily for regent. No, bad. Yeah, that black finger over there, that's the leveling up potion. I was debating if I want to use it or not. But yeah. Also, still debating for the sword. And yeah, that's the equipment I'm gonna use for her. Well, part of it. I'm not gonna cheat my way to victory that bad. I swear. Or not. But yeah. Going back to... Okay, let's get out of here. We've wasted enough time. time wasted on nothing okay back to the foggy bank let's go the other exit let's go clear it up yeah this place has the two left sides two big side one on the left and one on the right the center one is quite small nothing here to get except for the vendor quest that we did I will leave the caves for the next part if you uh, the caves is the next area we're gonna get I'm not repairing the bridge I never do repair the bridge because well it's kind of pointless since there's a portal on each side of the chasm yeah you don't need to cross it you just teleport that bridge is the only one you don't need to repair well if you're a completionist and it's bugging you yeah you can but apart from that nah. <laughs> sorry about that 
too much cola doesn't agree with me. But yeah. Mm, didn't put anything on the amulet. Oh well, gotta get something for my stash. But nah. Also, this place is hell. We'll be fighting a hero soon enough. Luckily for me, it was not. She was not that strong. Cause if it, she would would have been, I would be dead. But yeah, dead is dead. Also, mace that I'm not gonna use ever. But yeah, more of these guys. Because why not, right? I mean. The map to run are for everybody. Also, two-handed axe. Cool. More of them. I like. I love shield slam. Shield slam is great. Especially the ground stomp ability when it triggers. That and Curse of Frailty, it's awesome. I think I will be getting bloody pots, just for the kick of it. <laughs> it would be funny to see them die. <laughs> oh yeah, that and Sigil of Consumption and we are good to go. We won't be having any problem with die with such a lot of consumption at all uh, I like also I do believe that's a two-handed sword why am I getting two-handed weapon for a one-handed kill build I will never understand the loot drop generator in these games <sighs> also, that's the hero right there, mucked up with the star. And you can see, she's doing quite well for herself. Yeah, definitely I'm changing back to the sword. Mr. Vile, the Unstoppable, will gonna get stumped soon. I really need to watch this and take notes of the names of the bosses from now on. I really do. Cause this is stupid. But yeah. Nothing here to see. Just me cleaning the house. Also, yeah, we're almost done. Almost. And we're approaching the 20 minute mark. So yeah, we're almost done here. We're gonna be getting to the next part of... We're gonna be approaching our quest, the town of Burwitz. Yeah. That's a fun, that's a fun place to be at, trust me. Wily fun place to be at. Yeah, that maze is not gonna cut it at all. Oh, come on. Goddamn lawnmower. Why? Yeah. That's the crap from living at the countryside. You get stuff like that. But yeah, we're closing up to where? That is the bridge. You need 3 scrap and 5,000 iron. Not worth it. Because, like it or not, you want to go through here. More experience. But yeah. I was debating if I wanted to do uh, this 
place in one video and finish leveling up but we'll do that in the next part but yeah that is it for now i hope you guys enjoyed it and see you guys next time also feel free to like to dislike and comment a lot it helped me get better also please check out the vam my vampire the masquerade bloodlines series and some of my boss battles and if you are one of my 11 subscribe wonderful subscribers thank you for being there for me and bye bye this is nikki posing for the camera and bye now